Yo, what's going on, ballers? It's 2K2Can back at it. Alright, so a lot of people have been talking about, you know, Paul George especially, but maybe perhaps even LeBron James, them both going to the Lakers this offseason. You know, it's not out of question. They are. The Lakers honestly have a lot of cap space if they, you know, do everything right this offseason. Um,. So it's it's a possibility. My me myself, I think Paul George is more likely to go there, but we'll just have to see what happens. Cause you know it is the NBA after all. All right. So I just simmed um, this past season that just happened in real life. So I just simmed that here, and now we're in the off season. So I'm gonna try to get Paul George and LeBron on this team. Now, Paul George probably will opt out of his contract with the Thunder and we'll probably be able to sign him. LeBron James um, most likely won't opt out of his contract so we'll probably have to trade override for him. Um, but that's what this whole rebuild is going to be about. It's going to be two years. Um, I'm going to see if I can get the championship and that's we're going to see what's up. Alright, let's go. All this nonsense we don't care about. Uh, let's see who. Yep. Paul and Dirk got in. Mono. Doesn't look like he got in. We'll reject all those this year. League realignment. Nothing different there. Alright, draft lottery. So the 76ers have our pick this year, I believe. Yeah, they do. And we were really bad last year. Um, so they have our our third overall pick. Okay, um, but as a matter of fact, Lonzo did get rookie of the year last year. Probably because I played him like 38 minutes, but he he averaged about 12, 7, and 9. So, pretty good. Um, but I believe, yep, so we have the 21st pick via Cleveland, so that's not bad. Um, but that's not really going to be too much of a concern. Because that's not really what this rebuild's about. Okay, staff signing. I do want to try to get Owen Masters in here. Um, and Newman. Okay, let's see if we can get these guys. And we get them both. All right, nice. So, I guess... Actually, so I'm going to try to clear up some cap space right now. Dang, we have to move him. Um, what can I get for him in the 13th and the second round? I'm just trying to clear up cap space. So anything where I clear up cap space, I'll take. Okay, that's not bad at all. That's not bad at all. Yeah, I'm going to take this one. I cleared up about 16 and a half mil. Um, so we have the 21st pick. So I'll see you guys at rookie signings. Alright, what's up ballers? Um, so 21st overall, I took Giannis' brother. Um, I don't know. He's going to be a G League player for us for sure this year, but we'll see how he progresses. So, let's move ahead. Zubach, year declined. Brandon Ingram, we're bringing back. Yep, LeBron accepted. Paul George declined. Okay. Qualifying offers. Yep, we're going to offer that. Alright, we're going to get... Okay. We're not going to have money for LeBron James, George, and Durant. Plus, Julius Randle, and yeah. So, let's try to bring Paul George in. So, we're going to give Paul George 2998, or as much as they let us. Actually, no, not as much as they let us. 30. Uh, I don't want to. I guess I'll give him a play option. Alright, there. We'll do that. Actually, no. Might as well just give him a no-trade clause, too. Why not? All right. So, we really need a center. Greg Monroe is a really good option for 12. Lopez, I mean, 
He already knows the system, I don't know. He's not much older. I want to offer him a contract. Two years. Player. Alright. Paul George. We're getting him. Um, we're probably getting Brooke Lopez too. Okay, that's good news. That means we're probably losing Isaiah Thomas. Because I don't think we can afford him. We're going to offer him a contract. And see if we can. But... No, we're not going to offer him anything yet. Alright, let's do this first. Alright, so we get both of them. Renounce rights, cap hold. We'll see if anyone gives him an offer. We'll match it if we have to. Isaiah, we're going to cap hold if we can. Okay. Paul George. And then... Okay, so we got both of them. That's everything we need to do. Isaiah Thomas still has no offers. Julius Randall only has our offer. So we're gonna... Okay, I'll, I'll see you guys at the end of free agency and you'll see who I sign. All right, guys, so this is our team right now with no um, LeBron James yet. We have 35.1 mil in cap room, so just enough. We lost, we signed Julius Randle on the qualifying offer. We lost Isaiah Thomas to, I wonder where. Oh, he's a free agent? What the heck? We can't sign him though. We can't offer him that much. Right, we're not gonna sign him yet. We can't. So I'll see you guys at training camps. All right, now we're at training camps. Um, I'm gonna get LeBron on the squad now. I mean, I in real realistically, this would be he wouldn't be a, it wouldn't be a sign and trade. He would. He would just go and sign there, so I'm not gonna give them anything crazy. I don't. Why would. 500,000 more? Okay. Yep. We're gonna do that. And I'm gonna shut off trade override. Not that. We probably won't be doing too many more trades. Actually, we'll see. Alright. I'm going to do untapped to potential to Lonzo. Untapped potential to Kuzma. And untapped to Josh Hart. Those are all people that I want to you know, keep on the team for at least this season. So, we'll see what's up. Alright, let's see what our lineups are going to be for this year. No, that's not. Paul George wouldn't come here to be the sixth man. Realistically, Ingram. Uh, pretty good bench. I don't know. I don't think. Kuzma needs way more minutes. He's going to be getting 30. Lopez, 28. Randall, 30. No, they need more minutes there. 20, 23. 6 man. 10. 32. 34. Oh, yeah. This guy's out. 31. 31. 31. 35. 35. 34. There we go. All right. I'm going to do LeBron James and then Paul George. Alright, I'll see you guys at the trade deadline.
Alright, so I messed up and I didn't sign Giannis's brother. Um, I guess he's on the Nets. Kind of messed up there. Uh, oh well. But I really don't think I'm going to make any trades this year. They have us, you know, just pretty much everyone has us in the top 10 in the power rankings, like 9 or 10. Uh, everyone's having a decent year. I don't know. Our backcourt just might not be strong enough. We'll have to see. But if we do have to make any trades, we're going to make them next off season. So we're going to stick with what we got now. See if we... Yeah, LeBron's going to test free agency. We'll see. Um, we have bird rights, though. So I'll see you at the end of the season. Um, see if we can make the playoffs, which I think we can. All right, guys. So Steph got MVP again. Nice. I forget who got it last year. I think it was Russell last year when I simmed it. Luka Doncic, my bad, uh, rookie of the year. Larry Nance got six man. Okay. Steve Adams, okay. Wow, okay, interesting. And Steve Kerr, okay. 70 wins for the Warriors, wow. LeBron James gets first team. We see Paul, yep, Paul's third team, okay, beautiful. With LeBron finish with 22, 7, 8, and 8, and a half. 21, 6, and 5, alright. Alright, wait, what? 21, 5, and 5. Okay. Lonzo got first team all defensive last year. He gets second team this year. Okay. Average the double double. Good sophomore season, definitely. Especially with two superstars on the team like that. Um. Okay. Let's see what we can do. First round against Phoenix. So I'm feeling confident. We ended the season really strong. Um really strong they have us top four top five really in all of them and 11 and 4 the last month 4 and 0 the last week so we ended strong let's check out everyone's Kuzma had a really good sophomore season even off the bench definitely a contender for six man I'm sure but Lopez had a decent year I think he as a player option this year. We'll see what happens. Julius Randle, you know, not the best year, honestly, for a starter. Um, we're going to see what we have to do with him, but let's get through the playoffs. Ingram, wow. Not a very good year, but he got definitely the least amount of minutes of his career. Josh Hart, not a very good follow-up year, but 10 minutes less a game, so We'll see what happens, um, but against Phoenix, again, I'm feeling confident. Game one, we win. Game two, we win. Game three, we win. Sweep, swept them, okay. Only team to sweep, first round. Actually, Golden State has a chance up there. And, yep, only team to sweep. Oh, okay, I just did a boo-boo, and we got eliminated. Okay, against Houston, though, what was it? We were lost 30. Okay, lost by 30, and we won one on the road. That was big. And then we lost. And then we won. Dang, we. Okay, we're down 0-1. We we're tied 1-1. Up 2-1. We were up 2-1, and we lost it. Come on. Okay. So I guess that's the first year. Golden State wins in seven, and wow, Milwaukee beats Golden State. Okay, interesting. All right, well, I guess that's year one. What were the playoff stats before I go to next year real quick? 23. So George leading the score. Randall, ooh, that's tough. He had a really good postseason. Hmm. Okay. No league realignments, draft lottery. I think we have our pick this year. We should. Yeah, that 27th pick, though. Okay. Okay. I forgot we were really good. Head scout, I guess we'll sign 
him and see if he wants to come tentative why are you tentative bro why are you tentative Fleming come on Fleming you know you want to come you know you want to come play for us alright here we go so I guess I'll see you guys at rookie signings alright so with the 27th pick I drafted this dude 58 overall nice perfect um, said he had an A minus potential let's see what that held up to a B potential so still not bad throw him in the G League for probably two years he could definitely come off the bench um, our rebuild is not going to go this far so that's really a nothing pick alright so I just declined that again I think because I am not the smartest dude yep yep I did okay nice where is he there we go signed okay I don't think alright team player accept, accepted it nice he'll probably go down we'll have to see though we'll have to see so on white sides in there I don't think we're gonna we don't really have money to make free agent moves but um I don't think we necessarily need to anyways yeah but what are our cap holds 53 million dollar cap hold what the heck okay so our big the big thing we gotta do is bring LeBron James back and I think we can I'm gonna offer him 35 player option all right he's coming back so other than that we really don't have any money but we don't need anyone really I want to see if I can move maybe Brandon Ingram this year oh Julius Randle okay what's up with him bird rights no offers all right, let's see what happens with him. Cap hold, agree. We're gonna renounce all those rights. Julius Randle, no offer. So I'll see you guys at the end of free agency. See if I can get Julius Randle. All right, guys. So this is our lineup. Um, Josh Hart's up to an 80. Lonzo's up to an 88. James is at 98. George 91. Ingram 84. We got Randall back. We had to sign him on a three-year deal. Um, Brooke Lopez. So uh, we're going to try to have to make a move with Brandon Ingram. And I don't know. We're going we're gonna to need a big man. Julius Randall didn't really play too well first last year. He played. He scored well in the playoffs. He played well all around really in the playoffs. But, you know, knocked out in the second round. It's just not going to get it done. Um... So, I don't know. It's going to be a little bit tricky, but let's get through training camps. And I, I, I don't want to make a trade until the deadline, so I'm not going to. So, I guess let's just get through this. Um, I want to do offensive fundamentals this year to Lonzo. I want to do perimeter shooting to... Kuzma, I guess, and perimeter shooting to Josh Hart because those are the three guys that are going to stay on the squad this year. Um, so, yeah, I guess I'll see you guys. Actually, let's take a look at power rankings real quick. What do they have us at this year? They have us, 2K has us at 1, Mark Spears has us at 8, and NBA has us at 8. So, I think we can definitely be a top 2 team in the West, but we're gonna have to see what happens and I'll see you guys at the trade deadline all right guys so just got to the trade deadline and we're gonna definitely have to make a trade I just Lopez isn't gonna cut it for us this year he just can't rebound I don't know Brandon Ingram's not having a great year so I'm gonna see 
what I can do. I'm going to see if I can work out a trade um, for maybe a big man, and I'll see you guys when I have that. All right, guys, so this is really the best trade I can get. Um, I honestly think it's good value. Uh, we're losing Brandon Ingram, but he hasn't been playing the best for us. Obviously, he's a good bench piece. Abrinas doesn't play for us at all, but he carries two-star trade value. Clint, Clint Compella is going to fill that hole. We we need that hole filled down, though. So We're going to take that trade. Um, now, let's take a look at this. All right, yeah, I don't... Hmm. No, I don't know. That's interesting. I don't, that's not how I'm going to play it, though. This is what our lineup's looking like right now. we got Lonzo Ball, Paul George, James, Kuzma, Capella, Josh Hart, Julius Randle, and TLC off the bench. I picked him up for, traded him for, I don't know, a couple of spare guys off my bench because we needed a backup guard on the bench another backup guard so we're gonna roll like this for the rest of the year we'll see how it goes but real quick let's check out the stats Paul George is having you know a decent year but wow everyone's stats are down Capella yeah everyone's stats are down we'll have to see um yeah we'll just have to see how it goes we're, we're Definitely going to make the playoffs. I think we're going to make a hard push right now in the second half of the season. But then again, our chemistry is at 16% because we just made a couple of trades. So we'll have to see what happens. All right, guys. So we made a strong push at the end of the season. Um, I th still think we're like the fifth seed, though. Uh, Steph Curry gets the MVP again. Zion Williamson. Okay. Nice year. Marvin Bag Bagley. Six man. Rudy Gobert gets defensive. Most improved. Dennis Smith. Okay. Wow. Monster season. Steve Kerr, coach of the year again. Okay. Any Lakers? LeBron James gets second team. Lonzo on third team, all NBA. Okay. He averages 14 and 10. Not bad. But we don't see any Paul George here. Okay, Lonzo gets first team all defensive again. Nice. Okay, so that's it. Let's take a look at the power rankings first. They have us at eighth, sixth, and ninth. Okay, Capella finished with a double double. Played well. TLC didn't play that well. His first year in a couple of years too. He didn't play in eighteen. He didn't play in seventeen, eighteen, or eighteen, nineteen. Okay. Kuzma had a decent year. Randall. All right. What were our team stats? Points per game. Tenth. Points allowed per game. We're like eleven. Differential. We're eighth. So not bad. The Spurs the first round. Okay, interesting. And we are the fifth, the fifth seed. We won game one. All right, nice. Big game. Let's see if we can win game two. And we, okay, we come back. Huge second half, and we take both games on the road in San Antonio. That's huge. Game three, they win. Okay. We, have, we definitely have to take this game at home for us. We definitely have to take this game, and we take it. Okay. Okay. Okay, LeBron James with almost a triple-double. Julius Randle, double-double. Ball, double-double. All right, let's see if we can close it out right here. Gentlemen, sweet. There it is. All right. Golden State sweeps the first round. Houston sweeps the first round. New Orleans makes it out. 76ers against the Raptors, and then the Celtics against the Knicks. All right, Golden State. This is... It's so hard to get out of the West in this game. So hard. And, like, this is the second round. We're first in the Golden State Warriors. Like, you know, in all honesty, this is why LeBron James and Paul George would go to the Lakers so they could face up against Golden State and beat them. I mean, I don't necessarily think they would expect to meet in the second round because 
they would probably expect to be one and two seeds, but nonetheless, this is the matchup they would be looking for. Playoffs, Golden State, Lakers with Paul George and LeBron. So, um, let's see what happens here in the second round. All right, game one on the road. Okay, we have a huge first quarter. That's big for us. Okay. Okay. No. And we got blown out the rest of the game. All right. Let's see what we can do game two. Come on, guys. Come on. Got blown out that first quarter, but we're having a good second quarter, making a comeback. Okay, the game is tied right now in the third. This is big for us. we got to take one on the road right now. Ah. Uh, we let it we let it up in the fourth. Come on. Come on. Yep, we let it up in the fourth. Yep, we let it up. We could have had that game. We definitely could have had that game. What was the scoring looking like? Seth Curry, 50 points. Okay, come on. 50 points. Paul George, 35. LeBron, 17. Game three. I shouldn't have done that. And we're down 3-0. Okay, so you know, you know how it goes. No team has ever come back from a 3-0 deficit in the NBA playoffs. But, you know, we can change that, I guess. Are we actually going to take Are we actually going to take it? All right. Looks like we're going to take this game, but I'm going to jump in just in case cuz either way I want to get a few minutes um a game plan with this team. All right. Do we have Josh Hart? Why? What is going on? What is going on? Don't tell me. I right, want the ball. We need LeBron James in here. That's how we're gonna run it right now. We're up three. We just can't let anyone get loose on the screen. We gotta play hard. Ah, oh, huge play by Kuzma. Alright, let's see if we can take a little bit of time and get something going here. Alright, where's George? Come on. Alright, easy enough. We're going on the line. Nineteen point six for ten, five rebounds. Not bad, Paul George. You know, especially in real life, facing elimination, he d he doesn't always play the best in crucial moments. So, twenty points out of him here on a facing elimination, not too bad. Showing promise. All right, let's go, let's go, let's go. LeBron James back in the game. Lonzo back in the game. We're going to do something with LeBron. We got to. Okay. I stink. You get a screen? I'm driving. Get the two shots. Waste some clock. That's what it's about right now. Roll it in. LeBron, 17 points. Wonder what his rebound and assist look like. All right, Lonzo. Let's go. Let's go. First team all defense. Come on. I expect you to play hard right now. I think I'm going to try to feed the inside. Wow. I just... Wow. Are you kidding me? How do I miss that land? Ah, uh, okay. I can understand why I missed that one. Cause he shouldn't even have got it off. But come on. That first one, I definitely should have made. They're not fouling. We're only down three. Get an ISO with LeBron right here. What's up? What's up? Oh, I missed the step. <laughs> that was my bad. I beat him too and I missed the step. Okay. Now they're going to have to foul. Foul Kuzma. Kuzma's going to the line. Okay. 
sinks it. Up four. Two possessions. Come on. Only 19 seconds left. We could take this game. And we would be down 3-1. Nothing. Might as well lay it in. I'm not trying to get fouled. Sim to end. There we go, boys. Salonzo Ball dropped 25 that game. That's really good for him. But, like, look at the sound. Like, 20 from almost 20 from four players. And we got 10 from two others. I mean, Capella had a terrible game, but we still won. All right, I, I just want to check out these playoff stats real quick. See if we should change anything. Randall Kuzma. I think I'm going to give Randall the start. I think I'm going to have to. We need to salvage this playoff run because, you know, we're trying to win a championship. What, this is what this whole rebuild is about. This is why LeBron and Paul George would team up and come to the Lakers. They're not trying to get swept year two in a row in the second round. Only the second round. They're not trying to do it. So, Kuzma will make you the sixth man. Randall's going to start. Let's see if we can get a dub. Hey, it's not looking good. It's really not looking good, guys. Our season hangs in the balance right here. It's up to it. We have to have an incredible second half. Okay. We're holding tight. We got to we got to keep playing strong. Come on. Fourth quarter is what it's coming down to. It was all tied up. We're up 9. I think we're going to take it. Guys, if we take this game, it's huge. It changes the whole complexity of this. We could. We only need two more. We're going back home now, and we take the dub. We're going back home now, and then we just have to win one more. We survived a barrage of 33 points from Curry. George had 37 his own. Kuzma had 23. That's crazy. No rebounds. That's crazy. Absolutely insane. And that's. Right when we benched him. Okay. We'll keep him on the bench. Wow. New Orleans took out the Rockets. Are you kidding me? That's insane. Alright. Let's go. We got to take this dub. Wow. Terrible first half. Terrible first half. Doesn't look like we want to win the championship. LeBron says he's feeling old. George says he can't shoot. What is going on? Wow. We just get blown out. We had no chance. <laughs> That's crazy. We have Lonzo Ball, Paul George, and LeBron James on our team. And we have no chance. Like, we lose by 30. We lose by 30. How does that happen, 2K? I don't know. I don't know if 2K got this one right. Because... I don't know if LeBron and George are going to the Lakers this offseason, but I can say one thing's for certain. If they do, they wouldn't get knocked out two years in a row in only the second round, okay? It just wouldn't happen because, first of all, they would have a better regular season. I believe that. So they would be top seeds along with the Warriors. So they wouldn't face each other in the second round. And, you know, a Paul... Paul George, LeBron James, Lonzo Ball, and especially all the other players I had on this rebuild team, I think they could take out uh, Houston, no problem. So, I don't know if 2K has this one right. Maybe I just suck. That's it for my first rebuild. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you want, hit that like, hit that subscribe button, and I'm definitely going to try to be doing more of these rebuilds, you know, as much as I can. I don't know how much that is, but I hope you guys enjoyed. All right, see you next time.